Hi folks, Max from Galaxy Note 3 Root.com for this week's Verizon Galaxy Note 3 ROM of the week. Do check out Biggin's ROM. Uh, this is based on the latest Android 4.4.2 KitKat firmware. And uh, it's got slight theming here, as you can see here. Um, I really like it. Uh, it's got a custom S5 launcher. You gotta pull up to the camera if you want, or you can set it to whatever you want. Um, also, I've got to pull up to my Google Maps here, uh, <coughs> which is really nice. Um, you can set these here, left pull there, and pull up there. You can set your shortcuts. Um, you can go ahead and change it there. Uh, any apps you want to pull. Uh, very nice. But one thing I really like is that it is really fast. Um, just the launcher itself, I really love it. Uh, you know, number one thing I really like about it. Also, very good performance, very good battery life. And uh, let me go ahead and show you some of the apps it comes with. It comes with multi-window manager uh, and also pen window manager uh, right there. You can add all of your favorite apps to your multi-window, pen window. Of course, Viper for Android, my favorite Android app for uh, audio is on board. Uh, as a bonus, there's a, a Pandora that's been hacked. Um, this one gives you a uh, free, oh, not free, just ad free music, uh, which I really love. I mean, I'm, I'm blasting. I usually go to my local pool here and play pool with my friends. And I bring actually my Bluetooth speaker. I'm, I'm really good friends with the owner, so he, uh, sh uh, he lets me bring my uh, Bluetooth speaker. And they have uh, um, also, you know, one of those pay where you pay a dollar and play your favorite song. That's why I just bring my speakers and I start playing Pandora. And uh, it starts playing as, and I get to, you know, put the volume down. Um, with this Pandora, it's going to fix that issue. And also, Mobile Hotspot is working out of the box, so very nice stuff. Uh, also, if you want to customize your uh, phone, there is a bunch of themes you can choose from. Now, you see the default theme here. Uh, you can go ahead. Ah, you can go ahead and go to Set Theme uh, and uh, change it to green uh, or red or blue. And let's check out green right here, real quick here. Um, so I'm sure one of one of these uh, might satisfy uh, some of your favorite colors. Ah. There we go. So this is the green theme here. Um, it does not change the toggles, uh, but it does change the rest of the layout. Also, it does come with exposed modules. Um, to activate this, go to framework, hit install updates. Don't reboot yet. Go to modules and activate all the modules uh, you want to activate. Expose app settings. Obviously, this is an app um, that will allow you to customize uh, your apps to run in tablet, uh, custom DPI mode, network speed indicator, You'll get that up there so you'll know how much uh, data you're using. When I'm exposed, great for customizing your UI. You can add like torch, uh, torch, flashlights, shortcuts uh, while your screen's off. You can go ahead and hold down the volume up button. I do have a full tutorial guide on that. Uh, if you want to make the ads go away, um, you can click that also for YouTube. Um, so very nice set of features uh, without all the bloatware. But I really like it. Um, you know, the thing I really like is the speed uh, of this uh, launcher, and uh, overall the performance also is very good. Um, the it does come with S5 apps, as you can see here. Like the S Note is from the S5. Um, and where is it? All right the, there, we go. The the colors changed, so I kind of. Uh, threw me off there a little bit. A calculator, SMS, AccuWeather widgets, boot animation, um, some more stuff there. But overall, I really like it. It's you know not as full featured as HyperDrive. You're not gonna find as many features. But uh, this ROM is just as good. Um, it's you know a little bit simpler, but I kind of like it. It's a little bit simpler, um, so you don't have to know how to do a lot of things. Um, so definitely recommend it for those of you um, who are not too into like tweaking fully out you know you don't have all the time in the world to tweak out your phone or for those of you just starting out with custom ROMs this is definitely a good one to start with uh, but overall very good performance uh, very good battery life and uh, lastly let me show you some of the battery mods you can get with the OG battery mod um, so a ton of battery mods you can get there so definitely nice stuff um, so definitely check it out for this week's ROM of the week and do let me know what you think. And as always, if you have a Galaxy Note 3, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at uh, galaxynote3root.com. And I will see you guys soon. Um, have a great day. And, oh, yeah, it's got a uh, rotating uh, launcher to the side. To the sides. All right. See you all later. Have a great day.